One of the other recent changes to the game included barfing out more materials when you're chopping down trees and hacking away at, well, I think at rocks. I don't know. I never bother to chop down rocks because I don't have any use for that. That is a big old honking pile of wood. Now, I should clarify, just to be clear, clarify to be clear, yeah, that we do have the perk that gives us double drops, but that right there is 23 wood. Because look at that, boom. So, clicky, 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 clicky. There is so much less to do now when it comes to chopping down trees to get enough wood for stuff. I basically chopped down two trees and we've got uh, more than enough for what we need to do today which really won't be that much on the building side. But there is one other thing that I wanted to show you that I thought, hmm, that's something we need to do at some point. So let's make sure we get enough planks here to just have some leftover because I always like having a few left over if I can. There we go. I'm going to call that good enough. And then let us go to this guy where we need to... I think we still need to... Oh, here, hold on. We need to do... We need to do other things first here. Let's do that just to get rid of that so we can make some room for another door. And then I also want to make a bed, which it looks like we have just enough room. That's funny. I was going to make the joke of, hey, I switched backpacks and we lost room. But then when you scroll down, look at that. You got a whole two new rows of space. So it's definitely a more narrow, a narrower backpack. But um, overall, um, here, let's see if we can pick this guy up. And yes, I know we're not going to have any room for it anywhere. So shove it in a backpack. And then let's find out if placing a bled, a, a bled, a bled. Does placing a bled count as a spawn point? Because yes, yes, it does. Excellent. Well, if that's the case, then let's go ahead and turn this into a proper bedroom that uh, you probably can't get in and out of because you opened the door. Ah, uh, that's fantastic. Love it. Uh, that at least gives us a semblance of some furniture in this place. I don't know. I mean, whatever. It doesn't really matter. I uh, crammed some things in there, crammed some more things in another box, and uh, shoot, I don't even know, I guess. Here, let me just throw this over here because I really don't know where else to put it for right now. So that is the... Big old backpack that we used to be using, we used to use, that we are no longer using. And then this guy needs to go in there because that's its proper place. I did find some more guns we need to sell. I'm not going to worry about them right now. What time do we have? Three o'clock, huh? I guess that's fine. Whatever. I mean, uh, we probably will need to... Here, let's do this right quick. Um, this guy is ready to go. So we can just drop you out and swap you in. That way we can just have a nice fresh battery. And one of these days when it's dark in here, I'll turn on the generator again. Which will, of course, power up the battery charger and then we'll be good to go. Uh, let's see. I need to see. We got 98% fuel. We got 38%. We don't have a lot of fuel. So my inclination is to say, let's take the... The big old Humvee and today. Oh wow, there's all sorts of choices for what we can do today. Lots of infestations on the map. Oh, uh, that reminds me. Sorry, one more thing that I wanted to craft and I want to show you it. We're not going to be able to do it for a minute. All the way down here at the bottom, shipping container. I think that's a new thing that was recently added. I want to make one of those. I don't really know why. I just do. So let me go ahead and reload all of our weapons here. And then I will meet you at uh, where we're going to be hanging out today. This wasn't really our intended destination for the day, but since I do see a bandit boss right there, we'll go ahead and put a bullet in his head. And his. And his. And his. And his. And guess what? You get the last bullet in the head. And we'll destroy that turret. Perfect. So we're just going to go stop as we're swinging by over here. Uh, we're still going this general direction, but I figured, uh, you know, a boss, there is potential for something good here. And if there's any sort of compound box or something, then even better. I believe we still have one legendary weapon we have not found. Oh, wow. You had three lockpicks. That's the boss loot. Whoopee crap, dude. Who even cares? Like, seriously, but whatever. 
Uh, military supply crates. You know what? I will take those guys because those are handy. And as we dive into a thousand backpacks here, here, I'm going to put it all the way there. That way I can be annoyed later. That is my plan. Sure. Let's check this guy too. Anyway, uh, I believe we have one weapon we have not found yet. So our win condition of getting a boss kill with all of the legendary weapons is still a little out of reach. I mean, at some point, I'm either just going to have to bite the bullet or I don't even know something. Uh, here, let's move that guy right there because that will slide into that slot. And then that one too, because it's 150 bucks for the slot. Perfect. So I don't know. Um, we got, we still have some things we can do. Like there's still one or two new things, but honestly, we're kind of running out of new things. So, uh, you know, I'm going to have to make a, a call at some point of, do I just say we've done enough or do I just farm off screen and not post videos for a while because it's going to take uh, some time to do all this? I don't know. I, I got to figure that one out. Anyway, we're, we're not going to Bravo, so I'm just going to keep driving by it just so you know. This might end in disaster. I'm really not sure. Um, okay, so we can get in the water. Oh, interesting. Am I... Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, it seemed like I was, I was sinking there. I was not swimming above the surface level, but no, we're okay. I thought we would try and swim out to these wrecks, this oil rig and then the wrecks. I, I'm, I kind of feel like this might end up being a bad idea, but as I said, we're really kind of running out of new things to do. This is, I think, the only remaining thing I have not done in this game based on the current stuff in it. Now, that's not to say that it's not enough or that I haven't enjoyed it. it Actually, it is, uh, it is a fair amount of content, even though there will be more. But, you know, I've done it a couple of times now, with the exception of going out to this oil rig. I'm glad there aren't any sharks. I'm also assuming there aren't any sharks. Hmm. Right, let's see if we can get onto this craft first. This boat. This ship. Oh, uh, yeah, we can get up here. Now, it doesn't look like there's any reason to be up here, but, you know, I'm I'm trying to be uh, exploratory in all this. I'm trying to explore. I'm trying to see, like, what is there around here? What is there to find? I want to do all the things. I also don't want to drown, so let me just take a moment to get some stamina back. And also, I noticed that we needed to drink some water, so we'll do that right quick, too. So, water time, and then I think, um, I guess we'll just go ahead and eat some food, too. That's, that's fine. Probably need to bring some more MREs along, that way we have some just nice, easy, quick rations. I mean, it's basically what they are, right? Effectively. Alright, so I think we're going to be able to climb this ladder. Sure enough. What time do we have, by the way? 7 o'clock, so it's going to be dark here. Ooh. We are going to need the suppressor for this gun. And I don't have it at all. It's back at the base. Did not bring the suppressor. Okay. This guy's going to be a problem. Can we push you away? Like, and just keep pushing you? I mean, we can. Uh oh, I did not mean to fall back in the water. That was not intentional. I mean, obviously. Uh, here, let's do this then. Oh my gosh, it's getting very dark. I knew it was getting dark. That's why I was checking the time. Uh, can we... Can we sneak a shot? Perfect. I mean, this will actually work out just great. So if you guys want to stand right there, I can just plink away. I got no problem with that. Hi, how you doing? One, and uh, you're still alive, it appears, so sure. Take a body shot. And then, oh my gosh, I just looked up. Holy crap, dude. I think I need to switch this guy out here. Let's take this one, because we don't have enough ammo for that weapon. That is the Colonel's Revenge. But we do have a second mag for the Guardian. 
It's effectively the same ammo count. Uh oh. Um. That was a red guy. I'm. I'm kind of wondering here. Can you. Can you swim over here? I don't see him anywhere. <laughs> this is like not the way this is supposed to work. Game's like, what are you doing, dude? I know. Whatever. It's fine. All right. I'm, I'm just not going to worry about that guy because I'm not sure I can right now. My main concern is that if there are any ultra radiated or acidic, that's going to be a problem. So we'll just basically take out as many of these guys as we can right now. Oh, I see you. You are not my friend at all. Dogs in this game I do not like at all. No, no, no. Bad, bad dog. A couple more rounds left and we're going to have to swap mags. I mean, this is super efficient. I got no problem with the efficiency here. This is just great. I mean, Guardian is such a good weapon, like it really is. I love the Colonel's Revenge for a mag dump, but Guardian is a, just a really, really good, solid, solid weapon. Okay. I think we're probably safe to approach now. I'm super concerned, though, that since we only have one key card, that it's not going to be enough for this place. And if it isn't, I mean, it isn't, you know? But I really hope that it will be enough because I would like to see everything here. And I'm going to be a little annoyed if we don't have enough key cards to get around this place. Let's go and bust out. Oh, gosh, I don't even know what to bust out. I feel like I should just be making as much noise as possible. I did not bring a bunch of boxes to place down, by the way. Okay, if you guys want to hang out up there, that actually works out swell-like. Okay, that's one. Yep. Over the edge. And we'll use a bandage, since we're bleeding. Now, I half have a suspicion they followed. And if that's the case, that's kind of a shame, because I was not trying to drag them over the edge. That was not the intention if they did. Okay, now we're good. We're good. That's fine. All right, but then we got to pop some heads here. It is a shame that a bunch of them are just dropping over the edge their corpses are. I mean, the corpse of the corpse. A corpse is a corpse, of course, of course, unless a corpse is a corpse, of course. Hmm. That's harder to say than I thought it would be. Where is someone? Oh, I saw that guy just decide he didn't want to hang around anymore. That's cool. It doesn't seem like... Oh no, there's just a pile of bodies down there. I saw it. Did you see that? I saw it. Check that out. There's a pile of bodies down here. I was going to say... Oh crap! Oh crap. <laughs> I was wondering. <laughs> oh... I was I, I was super suspicious that there would be a boss zombie somewhere. Oh my gosh. That was horrible. Um, although, I have learned something today. Zombies survive on the bottom of the ocean. Or bottoms of lakes, for that matter. They are not bothered by a lack of oxygen. Which, I mean, duh, zombies. But eh, you never know. And dismantle the not zombies die as soon as they hit the water. So, uh, you know, different rules for different games. But gosh, I was super concerned thinking if we end up with a boss zombie on this place, I don't even know what we do about it. Like, legitimately, I don't know how we deal with that. I'm going to have to shoot this guy in the hand here or something. Perfect. Wow, I waited just a, a, a second too long. There we go. Um, I think they're just swinging their arms because of, you know, swinging their arms, not because they're alive. I think because they're 
ragdolling it. Oh, man. Here, let's go ahead and reload that guy, reload that guy. I am blowing through ammo for the 50 cal, and I was not expecting that to be the case. I mean, I knew we were going to use some, I just didn't think it was going to be that much. Um, nope. Okay, hold on. I don't want to, I don't want to drown. Let's get on the ladder and get on up. Get on up. Get on up. Alright, what do we have here? Does anyone have anything? We've checked most of these guys, but I think we have one or two new ones in the corner here. Uh, no. Okay. So we're going to call all of those good. And then I am going to whistle a bunch and back away. I mean, look, this place is super dangerous. If you don't like how I'm going through it, I completely understand. I also don't care. Just straight up. I mean, there's probably better ways to do it. I'm not saying that I, I'm not here for the uh, efficiency upgrades, and I hear you. If you got them, give them to me. Like, seriously, that's good stuff. Oh, hi. I want the experience. I don't know why, but I do. But if you don't like that I'm just kind of drawing everyone out to kill them, that's what I don't care about. Absolutely means nothing to me. Oh, boy. Holy moly, man. Goodness. It is just thick with zombies. Look at this. This is just terrible. This place is horrible. Why would you ever want to come out here? This is just awful. I hate this place. Why did I decide to do this? Ugh. Gross. This is just bad. This is... I think this is by far my least favorite location so far. In terms of... Just look at this. I mean... You know, it's funny. I, I had the thought... Around about when I was starting this one and I forgot to mention it. Hi, dog. You're still alive. I know you are. That um, we don't have anything on the Glock. I was thinking it had a compensator on it. And it does not. We found the suppressor, which I mentioned earlier, would probably be very helpful over here right now. But, um, no. I mean, it's good that we have these stupidly loud weapons because... It is working out very well to just have them make noise and pull all the zombies out. I got no complaints about that. Oh, did we not? Man, ran out of ammo on that stack. Okay. Let's continue then. I don't want to pick a lock. There we go. That took one. That's okay though. I'm going to leave all that stuff. It's not anything I'm interested in. Looks like it is now morning, thankfully, so we can see much better. I mean, it hasn't been awful, but can definitely see better now, so I'm, I'm totally good with that. We'll take a repair kit. We have quite a few of those now, actually, which is just nice, but I'm always good with more of them. Let's go and check our pallet here in the back, see if there's anything of interest. Compass, sure, we can sell that, and then I'm not going to sweat the rest. I think maybe I want the Glock as we come up here. I don't know. I mean, there's not really a good choice, I don't think. That console is not available. It's a novice lock. And uh, nothing of real interest in here. The MP7. I keep meaning to, to play with that again. That was a fun gun to use in the previous series. But really, the Battle Ready Glock with... The extended mag is basically an MP7. It just hits even harder. So, you know, what's not to like about that? I really wish I would have made some something to block the way. I mean, technically... <laughs> uh, good grief. Technically, we could make one of these guys to block the path. I don't think we have... We do have this right here. Forgot about that. I mean, 
I'm pretty sure zombies can walk right past this because I put it in a bad spot, but... Um, whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and climb up here just for the giggles. I'm probably going to kill myself trying to get down. It's my suspicion here. I have bad luck with ladders in games. I really do. And I don't know why that is. I guess I just don't know how ladders work. At least this one. This specific ladder right here is not super long. Uh, I'm going to guess we can climb up on this. And then... I don't know if this is... This whole thing right here, this truss structure, is something we can walk on. Is that how we get to that door up there? This looks very intentional to me. That you would drop onto that shipping container and then you end up at some doors down there. Oh, I'm going to have regrets, aren't I? Okay, this is going to hurt a little bit. Or not. Um, and I duck through there. Okay. There is a ledge right here. Oh, no, it's... It's not something you can access. Oh, bummer. Um, I think I'm going to die then. I think I have to just jump over the edge. Ooh. And that, that got deep into the water there. That was kind of dangerous. Because we know there's a boss zombie down there. Okay. Well, I'm glad I tried the platforming, even if it didn't really work out for anything. I was really feeling like, oh, look at that. I see what you've done here. I see what you're doing with all these uh, these things arranged in just the right way. No, that, that was actually completely irrelevant. That's fine, though. Here, let's go and drop this guy right there. That'll work for me. And I'm going to be kind of careful as I run around. This is where we're going to use our key card. And before we do that, uh, let's go upstairs. We'll come back downstairs for this. This this might take a minute for me to clear today because I have not been out to this location before. So I don't know what to expect. And therefore, I don't know where the zombies are going to be a problem. And I'm okay with that. I mean, that's that's half the fun here, right? I like doing some, some explorationing. And I realize that's not a word. Okay, I got that. I got that. Definitely take the ammo, though. That I'm pleased to see. Let's go check out what we got over here. Medical crate. Um, do we have any room? Okay. We'll end up using one of them. Pretty sure. There's another Barrett mag. We'll take that guy. And take that. Drop that in there. That will stack. That's fine. Drop that in there. I don't know why I keep leaving the shotgun shells there. I just, I guess they, they're comforting to have or something. I don't know. I got nothing. Sure. 250 cal ammo. And we don't need the mag. It's fine. I'm not going to worry about it. All right. Let us bust out this guy so that we can take care of our zombie there. Okay. This is a large one. And they are going to get up here. So let's put that away. And then let us be SMRT. Oh, you're not going to get up here. Okay, well, even better. If that's the case, then I'm not going to feel the slightest bit bad about this because you are big and you are mean and you will wreck my face if you even get the chance. And I don't want that, so I'm good with this. Perfect. Look at that. Good, 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 good stuff right there. Let's bust out this one. Here, let's move these guys just a little bit. Just so we can make it a little easier to collect some ammo, loot, etc. when they all fall over. And there we go. That is all good. Oh, that's why they didn't get up. Aha! I see that now. That is a collapsed area. So it looks like maybe we get over there through the back? I'm not sure now. Okay, well, let's pick this guy back up. 
And I know you need to be dragged into there manually. It's fine, whatever. Here, let's go ahead and swap our mags. I don't remember, did we get through all that stuff? Okay, yeah, we did, okay. Great, good. So let's see, we need more 762 into that one. We need more 50 cal into both of those. We'll just use them since we've got them. Works for me. I'm thinking maybe that key card is going to let us pass through into the area. Sorry, I heard all the footsteps and I started to freak out just a touch. Like, oh crap, where are they coming from now? It's the room below us. It's the key card room. And that's okay. Not super concerned about that at the moment. He says confidently. Okay, take some 45 or 556, whichever it is. Don't know. Doesn't matter. And then let's get up here where we know, I'm pretty sure we had some zombies we were shooting at up here. Yeah, because there's a pile of them in the corner right here. Which, God, we don't need any more antiseptic right now, I don't think. Backpacks. Uh, there's one more guy there. All right, nothing of interest. 2425. That is the keypad note. 2425. 2425. Got to remember that. Just got to think like fiscal year 2425. That would be the upcoming fiscal. It is not at that point yet. If you are a July fiscal, if you're a calendar fiscal, then, well, then you're just a 24. Mm, I kind of want to take this guy just because it's an easy thing we can drop to slow down the zombies. So this is... Oh gosh, I don't trust that fall. We'll, we'll use the stairs. I was looking at that going, I think we can drop down and it'll be okay. Yeah, see, we'll drop down to that floor. And then we still have another floor to go. As best I can tell, we do need to go through that key hard door. And gosh, I really hope we don't need a second one to get out of it. Because if we do... We have found a lot of key cards. We have only found a single key card for this place at this point. So that is a pretty big deal in my book. I'm pretty sure I just saw a boss zombie there. Um, I don't know if that's big enough to stop a boss zombie. I haven't, I haven't tried that technically. So let's use that. Um, oh, okay. So we don't need the key card there. It's just the keypad. Well, that's that's good. I'm fine with that. Okay. It appears that there's no one else in here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Figured there's no way there's no one else in there. I mean, like, come on. But I think we are good to pick this guy up now. And then we'll have to do a vicinity pickup on it. Two bucks. All right, um, where did the other one go? Did they fall? Kind of fell on top of each other. All right, I need to, I need to stop this. I'm, I'm at my, oh no. Okay, still not enough. Well, we're at 17% on the filter. It's quieter. That's fine. It's quieter. I'm okay with that. I should have just used the whole thing, but I didn't want to. Lots of ammo, lots of ammo, lots of good stuff here. Mosin clip, okay, so we don't need any more of those things. I'm just going to stop. I don't want to fill up all the boxes yet again. I just want to enjoy the exploration. There's another Guardian mag. That's spectacular. Let's take that guy, drop you, and we'll put our lockpicks up there. And this will sort of allow us to have... Uh, all right, you got to go in there. This will allow us to swap our magazines out a little more efficiently. Uh, we'll take that guy. That's fine. We don't need any more polymers. I'm, I'm okay with leaving that stuff. Take and take and take. I'd attempted to just swap filters right now. Is that the big... Is that the cargo ship? cargo plane that drops 
supplies. I mean, I wasn't noticing that sound before. Where is that? Airdrop incoming. I don't think I have ever, ever noticed, seen whatever. Look at that. Okay, I got to make a point of getting to those because I have never seen an airdrop in this game. Do you have to wait 30 days? Is that why? Because I don't think I played 30 days on my first go around. I don't, I don't remember at this point. Okay, we're just going to swap filters out right now. It's fine. I'm going to drop that. I don't even care. Like, seriously, we have so many filters. It's not even worth carrying that around anymore. They last so long now that I'm perfectly fine with that. That is that is totally good. Don't even care. It does not matter. Now let's reload our Glock. I am still a little concerned about having enough ammunition for this place, but so far it's been fine. Elevator's blocked over here, but we'll go ahead and check this crate. Prison key card, rad pills. Uh, you know what? Here, let's do this. Um, I'm just, I cannot take this anymore. Do that and consume that. Perfect. All that good. Okay. Gave us a little bit of hydration, a little bit of food. We are good. And it stopped the annoying rattling. Tick a tick a tick a tick a tick. I just cannot take it. it. Oh, it's just like nails on a chalkboard. This is the window we got to earlier. And yeah, it doesn't look like we can... I don't think we can destroy this with a katana. I don't feel like busting out the axe to find out. Hey, look at that. There's a second oil rig key card. If we need two, we now have two. That actually gives me just a measure of comfort that... We might be okay then. Like, it really truly does. I'm like, okay, we might be good now. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. I think everything else is good. We'll leave all that stuff. Hmm. So to get around on the rest of this place, we have to go a different route. I wonder if we have to fall, because that just seems problematic, if so. Um, tack helmet... Spec Ops helmet, so we've got all those things. Check the trash in here right quick. Don't care. As long as I don't have to pick the lock, I'm happy. I don't care. It's fine. Deagle. Uh, I might take the Deagle just to have it handy, although... Nah, that's going to be a bad idea to use it because that's what we're using for our, our sniper. I did not bring a different sniper rifle either. This is the only one we have is the Barrett. Did not bring any others at all. Why? I don't know. I mean, the Guardian's close enough. Look at that. Four credits and a decent chunk of cash. That's not bad. Okay, so let's go ahead and... How do we get through this place, then? Obviously, we got to go out here. So it looks like we can go around the pipes. I bet you this is the intended route. Yep, and then there's a ladder over here. This is all very good. I like this. This is very, very good. Okay, and then this gives us a pretty safe place to whistle from. Just to see if there's anyone else around. It doesn't seem like it. We do have one more building to go through, though, so... We do need to be mindful that there could still be a boss zombie in there. I mean, we found the large undead guy and we shot him down. His corpse has probably vanished by now. That's all right if so. It's not the end of the world, but they are a good source of legendary stuff. There's another Barrett mag. I don't know that we need one, but we'll take it anyway. Uh, you. Can that not stack? Oh, wow. Okay. I guess we filled up our, our MRE slots. Uh, there is technically a 700 right there. I mean, maybe what we should do is grab this guy and we'll grab... I guess we'll grab a hollow site for it. Oh, it doesn't work. Never mind. <laughs> maybe we could put the suppressor on there. That's fine. Uh, just, just so we can have a spare in case we need one. I'm sure we have left so many scopes and things behind. 
There's a Guardian ACOG. What do we have right now? We have the Guardian Long Scope. That's cool. Another Guardian Long Scope. Another Guardian Mag just straight up. I don't have... Um, actually, let's put that guy in there and we'll put... That's a bigger mag. That's a that's a long mag right there. That's a tall boy. Oh man, that's spectacular. Like seriously, I am super excited about that. Holy crap. I mean, we've got three mags for this gun in reserve. Never mind, we, you know, have one we're actually using. Okay, so that way we cannot go so clearly we're supposed to just come over here where you then find the boss zombie and you get wrecked. I think that's the intended path. <laughs> Which, man, that's brutal. Like, there's not really a good place to run over here. I mean, you can kind of jump up there. Like, get on, on that, I guess. There's some railings there. I guess the boss guy hasn't vanished yet. I figured, eh, there's a decent chance he hasn't. Really hasn't been that long. But considering he's a large one, that was a very disappointing pool of loot. Like, super underwhelming, but that's all right. It's not the end of the world. Let's check these guys here. Drink that, take that, drop that. Someone was definitely, there we go, ultra radiated. It was that one just as I was saying that. Um. Oh, all right. Bodies are vanishing. I don't think I grabbed the money off of that one either. I think it didn't stack, and so I didn't react quickly enough to it not stacking, and then the body just vanished. Take that deagle mag, whatever, it's fine. Okay. This place is pretty cool. I like it. I hate it. But I do like it. But I do hate it. Let's go inside over here. I feel reasonably confident in saying that we have taking care of everyone. Oh, hardened. There we go. There was no danger of running out of lockpicks, even though it says four. Really, there was not a problem there. Sure, eat the cereal. We don't need it, but it's fine. Uh, sure, search the lab desk. Hey, another one of those backpacks. I'm not going to worry about taking it because that's going to require going 17 bags deep just to store it somewhere because it's so large. But that is pretty cool that we've now found two of those. I mean, successive episodes, no less. That's kind of interesting. What are the chances of that, right? Keep out. Okay. I will keep out then. Thanks for that. Let's go around to the other door. Or other doorway. And we'll see if we can get inside from here. We still have not used the key card, mind you, so I'm still waiting to figure figure out what's going on with that. Oh my gosh, here, that... Oh, these don't stack. Oh, they don't stack, I see. Well then here, drop those guys in there, because that's SMRT. Not gonna worry about moving everything else around, it doesn't really matter. Uh, just go ahead and consume that, because we'll take... Ugh, I mean, all this stuff, like, I don't even bother, bother carrying the rest of those things. We have so many antibiotics and rad pills and all the things that it doesn't really matter. So, this door, is this just going to open out? It doesn't even open. Okay. I was going to say, is it going to open out to that hallway? Because that's what it looked like it would do. Drop that guy off. Here, we'll take the rag. I know we didn't need to do it that way. I'm just being persnickety. What can I say? Again, none of the stuff that we really need. I forget, did we... We picked up a military crate, though, right? No? Did we put one in there? I thought we picked one up somewhere, so fine. I'll just drop that there. That's okay. Um, I've never managed to do this before. Okay. <laughs> Moonwalking. Big time moon... Um, what in the world... Um, okay. There we go. I somehow got stuck in that. I had to go into right-clicky Amy mode to break that. So I'm going to guess this is the final loot right up here. This is going to be the key card. Which, if that's the case, then I understand why, perhaps, why the oil rig 
key cards are rare. You don't really need many of them. Um, sure, drop that in there. That's fine. And take that. That's good, too. Broken crate. And then... I don't hear anyone. So, that was the key card used. Oh, wow. This is quite the loot room, though. All right, let's see if it was worth it. I mean, it was worth it, but let's see if it was worth it. Um, we don't have room in that guy. All right, whatever. That's fine. Just go ahead and take it. I don't care. I don't think we need another Lechi long scope. I think we already have one, but just in case, we'll go ahead and take that. Uh, I do want to take frags, so those I will take. Military locker. Come on, man. Classified area key card. We'll take that. We'll take... Those things, I mean, the rest of this stuff, gosh, we are leaving behind so much good stuff. And you you can totally disagree with my leaving behind all these things, and that's fine. We can have a great discussion about that. I don't feel compelled to take this stuff because it just seems like we already have so much that it doesn't really matter to me. I don't need any more of this stuff. Okay, let's see what's in the first one, MRE. I'm just going to go ahead and chow on that now for the hydration. Uh, I guess we could take this guy. Where did we put that rifle? I don't think we need it, but just to try to be, I don't know, consistent to try to follow through. These guys, I usually do like to collect these just because you need them to make the military crates. Although we've got two of them in inventory, so I'm not sure it matters at this point. I think we kind of have everything we need for the base. Uh, we have filled up that box of ammo, so you go in there now. Okay, I, I think this is uh, all good. We have done all the things. Let's check the roof just to see what's up here. I mean, it does look like we have a suitcase, if nothing else. Got some luggage. Uh, nothing of interest there. Heavy coat. I think there's still um, a, part a particular piece of clothing that was added, like a hunting vest or something, that I still have not seen to this point. Something like that, anyway. Man, I'm really excited about that. The tall mag there for the Guardian. That's, that's a good find. I like that a lot. Uh, so this is going to be... How we get down? I mean, I know there's stairs, but I guess that is the way to go. That looked like that was maybe too far of a drop. I just, I don't think that was going to end well for anyone. And we'll put the sword away. We don't need that anymore. And then I guess from here, we can just go ahead and uh, get out of here. I'm going to hit the water and then maybe we'll jump from over here. I'm just trying to think, like, uh, what's going to get us closest to getting out of this place. We need to go back that way, right? We need to go... I don't even know where I left the truck. I think it was back here-ish. So we need to go somewhere over there. Let's get rid of that guy. All right, well, I'll meet you over there. I didn't stop to check to see if the boss zombie was following uh, until I thought about it a minute later. I'm like, oh crap, if that guy's following, that could be bad news. He wasn't following. It was fine. I don't know if I want to get out to that other shipwreck over there. That one, maybe I'll leave for another time. Maybe I can leave that for my third playthrough on the game or something. But I did notice this lighthouse as I was swimming out to shore. And I thought, you know what, let's go check this out and see what there is. What's going on in here? Uh, you know what? We didn't even need that. That's hilarious. I thought we were going to for sure use this guy at some point, and uh, we did not. Midnight every night. Find the four, and at some point, find the truth. What does that mean? Find the four, and at some point, find the truth. I'm intrigued. What does that mean? There's some sort of mystery going on with the lighthouse. I like that a lot. Um, okay, let's knock it. Let's not fall down in here. Doesn't look like there's anything up here, but I kind of want to come back at midnight now and see what it's talking about. Like, I don't know that I'd be able to figure it out, but find the four and at some point find the truth. I'm going to die. There we go. 
Yep. All right, you. Ladders and I. Ah, uh, see, I'm stuck in that, like... Um... There we go. I was stuck in moonwalking mode again for some weird reason. I don't know. I got nothing. Nope. Don't refuel. I don't need fuel. All right. Let's get out of here because I do want to go. Oh, I did not mark them. Crap. Where were they? I have no clue where they were. Maybe the airdrops have already vanished. They were somewhere-ish over here. I'll just go make a quick drive by. I don't expect to find anything. But I do want to look. Oh, look at that. We got ourselves another bandit camp. I mean, I guess. Since we're driving by, we started with one. Oh, maybe that is the one. Huh. I was going to say, maybe this is the one we wiped out earlier, but... I don't think it is. I know I see someone else over there. Okay. Get rid of their... Gun. Oh, my bad. Guys. I mean, we do have several repair kits. Oh, crap. We're going to need them. Stop. Okay. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Okay. Is there anyone else around? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, let's check these guys right quick. Uh, sure. Drink and consume. And I don't know. Did we keep the can? There you go. You can have the can back. Hey, guys. They're all dead. Just making sure. That might have been excessive, but, uh, you know, it's okay. We're alive and that's all that matters. I really don't think we're going to find anything for... Oh, gosh, I guess I should take those... Those airdrops. I, I think maybe they vanished or it's only marked for a moment. And I didn't intentionally mark them on the map because I kind of wanted to see what would happen. And I believe now I might need to mark them on the map. And if so, that's fine. Not a big deal. I'm not worried about it. Nothing of interest here. We can just move on. Okay. I mean, I'm glad we stopped just for the giggles, but that really didn't do any good, so it's fine. Uh, we'll just take another moment to drive up the road here, because this is kind of in the, the general direction here that I marked for the airdrop. And like I said, I'm not really... Oh, buddy. Don't wreck my car. Okay, don't wreck my car. That's what I get for not paying attention. I knew we didn't kill everyone, or at least I, I felt like that was a, a small amount of bandits, but whatever. I'm assuming if this were the right place, that there would be something somewhere that would grab my attention to say, hey, supply drop here, you know? Stop, check it out, man. But I don't see anything, and we can... Go ahead and turn up the road here. I think that's another bandit camp, most likely. Mm, look at that, friendlies. That's cool. Yeah, I I don't think. I mean, I guess uh, we'll check. Excuse me, as I plow into this van, we'll follow the road a little bit because I the other spot I thought was maybe around the turn here. And I just, I didn't remember. I don't remember. I didn't pay enough attention, all the things. And I still need to go collect, like, a crap ton of salvage to make that shipping container. And I know, passing by vehicles we can salvage, but I'll, I'll do that on my own time. It's fine. I don't need to torture you with more salvaging here. Let's take a look at what we got going on out here. Hi. I'm busy, if you don't mind. It would be kind of appropriate if the bandits were guarding the drop, like if they had snagged it somehow. But I think it's unrelated. I think it's just that we happen to have bandits. That's all. So let's go ahead and annoy everyone in a four-mile radius. I still feel like there should be one more somewhere. Maybe off in the woods bit. These are not going to be ones that have... You know, really good loot, no uh, boxes or anything. They're just, you know, your standard standing in the road bandits. But hey, I'll take some nine. I mean, look at that. That's not bad. I'm really, really kind of happy with all of that. Yeah, we got some decent stuff out of that. That was actually not bad at all. 
All right, let's finish up this road here. We're gonna swing around a little bit. There's the green smoke. That's the drop, I think, I hope. And if that's the case, then the other one is going to be a little further down the road too. Look at that, dude. I have not found one of these yet. This is great. Super excited to see. What do we got? All right, search this thing. What's in these? <gasps> wow, another katana. I mean, we don't need one. These are massive drops. Look at this. There is so much stuff in here. Like, I want another katana just on principle. I have no reason to take one. I just want one because I can. Look at all of that stuff, though. There's, like, legitimately a deagle, a katana, two proper sniper rifles, an MP5, and then a lot of uh, other things. <laughs> a lot of parts. Some backpacks. Ah, oh, that is great. I'm going to guess this red smoke over here is the second drop. I'm curious if they're the same. I'm also curious if I have it set so that it's 30 day drops, because if so, oh, look at that, we can move it around. That's a long time to go without a drop. I would rather have it at like seven days. So this one is just full medical. Wow. I mean, that's cool. That's great. Look at all that stuff. There's like legitimately, there's just great stuff in here that we don't need because we have so much of it. I mean, I guess just for the giggles, we can throw some more of these guys in here. But beyond that, I don't think I care to grab the rest of that stuff. I'm going to call this one a rather successful episode. We will rejoin on the next one. I'm going to head back to base. Maybe I will stop and grab some salvage on the way if I remember. I'll catch you on the next one. Till then, thanks for watching. See you later.